so hello again we have reached exercise uh, uh, 9 concerning integers manipulation so we are asked to write a program that reads two integers x and y and then we should do the following x will take the value of y if x is less than y or y is a divisor of x so y the divisors is the one of the divisors of x and or uh, y will take the value of x if x is greater or equal than 30 and y is a multiple of x so let's begin so we need two integers x and y and the user should enter these two values so enter enter two integers and then we do a scan of percentage d percentage d address of capital x and address of capital y and then we need to see what will happen so uh, let's print that print off let's print the value of x and y x so let's say before modification modification is backslash n backslash t so we, we go to the line and then we do a tabulation x equal uh, like that backslash n backslash t y equal percentage d then backslash n so first backslash uh, percentage d is for x and the second one one for y so we'll do the treatment here and then again we will print at the end so after modification we will print again the value of x and y so in the middle we will do we will check so if x is less or equal than y as it's written here or what does it mean y is a divisor of x so y can divide x it means that the division of x by y is complete so it means that x modulo y is equal to zero this means that y is a divisor of uh, x in that way x will take the value of y so x will be equal to y the value of y will be given or uh, put in x otherwise so in the same we don't change so if we write then if without else it will be conversion because at this stage here at line 24 the value of x have changed changed so i cannot later on compare it uh, with 30 and do the second one so it's either that or that so here we should have an else the else here is very important so else it means if this one is wrong we will check the second condition so y will take the value of x if x is greater than 30 and it's written and y is a multiple of x what does it mean y is a multiple of x it means that x divides y y is a multiple of x for example y equal 2x 3x 4x it means that x is a divisor of y it means that y modulo x is equal to 0. So this is it. We have finished. So let's run it and see some examples. So we need, let's see, uh, take two examples here where one we have exchange. Uh, let's take three examples. One for this case, one for this case, and one that don't match any of these cases. So let's say that x is less than y and we need that x uh, modulo y is uh, or equal to zero so any number that is less than one of these should be correct should be true so we can take 10 20 and then we will have at the end so we will have before x equal 20 and y equal 20 and then in x we will have the value of y so 20 will be equal will be set also in x so we'll have this one let's take another example where uh, for example this one will uh, will be executed so in this example x should be greater than 30 so let's say 30 and y modulo x equal equal to 0 and y uh, divided by x should be equal to 0 so uh, what it could be that let's say 30 so if it's 30 x will be equal to y and we will end up here so if it's equal will not will not it will end up with the same so it's not very so wh where can we use that it's very cumbersome because x should be more than 30 let's say 30 and, and we should find a y greater than x which is a multiple of 30 so it could be 60 
but 60 will end up in here so we'll never enter this case 35 so we'll end up with here x equal to y so let's take a number where it doesn't work for example y x shouldn't be uh, less than y so it's uh, it's greater let's say 40 and 30 so in 40 and 30 will not be here because 40 uh, uh, y 30 is not a divisor of 40 and x is greater than 30 but y is less than 40 so will not be in here so we'll end up with the same value so this is it for this exercise if you have any questions do not hesitate to uh, write to me and I will, I will answer you back and thanks for watching